Tony Hill, I'm with Hillco Technologies, uh, based out of Nespers, Idaho. Um, we're working on a um, cob collection system here. This project is a joint effort between uh, our company, Hillco Technologies, and uh, based off and working closely with John Deere, based on technology that was originally worked on by Deere and Iowa State University. So uh, this product is really focused on cob collection. Uh, it's a single pass cob collection system. And when we talk about biomass collection, there's really kind of two two terms that are commonly used. One is a, a single pass collection and the other is two pass collection. A second pass collection would be more like uh, taking a combine and laying a windrow on the ground and then baling it up. Uh, this is a single pass collection system where while we're harvesting the crop, uh, we're also b harvesting the biomass in the very same pass. So when we move through the field, by the time we get through harvesting the grain, we've got the biomass harvested as well. So um, there's some advantages of single pass systems in the fact that um, it's uh, uh, we collect a higher percentage of the cobs or the biomass because we're not putting it on the ground. The biomass is, is cleaner because we're not subjecting it to, to the dirt that's on the ground when we go to pick it up. So um, the other advantage too is is that once we're done with the single pass system, uh, there's no residue left in the field at that time as far as the, what we're trying to pick up. So our operation's done, we can move on. Any tillage type operations that need to take place after the fact can go ahead and happen with single pass, which makes it also nice if the weather conditions are bad. Um, typically in single pass collection, we, since we never put it on the ground, even in, in bad conditions as far as weather-wise, we can go ahead and still collect. Um, right behind me here is the, uh, this is, uh, the system really consists of two parts and it's, uh, there's the attachment that attaches to the combine and it's specifically designed for use on John Deere STS combines. And um, it attaches right to the back of the machine, is carried on the combine, and the second part of the system is the cart. So, what I'll do is I'll give you a, just a real quick run through on the basic operation or how, how it works on the attachment. <coughs> we keep the, the system is bolted to the combine without any modification to the machine. Uh, we take material coming off of the chopper of the combine and this, this is called a spread collect gate right here. And what the spread collect gate does is it, if we're in the up position, then material coming out of the chopper goes underneath it and goes into a tailboard or a hydraulic power cast type tailboard. <coughs> so we can go ahead and spread the residue on the field. And then with a push of a button in the cab, we drop this door down and we go into what we call the collect mode, where material enters into the chamber in here. And once the material heads up into the chamber, it collides with a rubber curtain, stalls the energy out of the material. And then on top of the, we have two twin cleaning fans. Those fans suck the lighter material off the top and then the heavier cobs fall down into a cross auger. That cross auger augers them over to a blower system which in turn uh, heads it up through the spout. Now what's nice about a two part system having the attachment and having the cart is is that <coughs> in, instead of uh, if we've got good field conditions where we can pull a cart in the field we can go ahead and transfer material directly into the cart. But if we have adverse conditions where where it might be too muddy in the field and we don't want to pull a cart behind the combine, and then we can go ahead and offload pretty much like a forage harvest system. We can offload directly into a tractor pulled cart. This cart is specifically designed as a lightweight, uh, low horsepower requirement cart so that we can collect biomass directly behind the combine. It's, um, it's a combination, this cart is, of, of, a, of a dump style cart along with a live floor chain. So unlike a dump cart which has to entirely tip up and dump the load out, this cart actually lifts up about halfway and then the live floor and it goes ahead and offloads the material. Uh, what's nice about that is, is that um, from, from the standpoint of lightweight, we can pull it behind the combine with minimal impact on harvesting. And uh, we can collect that material right behind the machine. And then, once, uh, depending on the operation or, or the customer that has it, uh, he might just have a cart and he might carry that material to the edge of the field and then create a cob pile at the side of the field. The other option he has is, is he can offload from this cart into a dump cart, and that dump cart could take it to the edge of the field as well. So, it gives us some versatility in terms of how it can be used in the field.